And the question now is how do we help? How do we prevent the next catastrophe? How do we help people make individual decisions? How do kind of we pull out of this of this mess? And I think this is what the conference is about. It's about both individuals and regulators and how do we combine our forces to make sure that uh, we, we give people the best tools possible not to make mistakes. The highlight has been the combination of people from government, industry and academics. And I think it's this uh, interchange between us that gets the academic to get real world kind of grounding in what's really bothering people and what's the real issues and also get something from regulators that get us to see what is possible and what is not possible. I came to the conference because I'm interested in understanding how consumers make decisions because we have a mandate to protect consumers. We want to have the best information possible to be the best policy. I think the quality of the papers has been fantastic and having a mix of psychologists and economists who sometimes have different perspectives and trying to find the overlap of those perspectives. I came because it was some of the best people in the country in the new world of consumer finance. So it was a great chance for me to learn and hear what they're up, up to. Uh, so far it's been a lot of fun to hear people in industry and a lot of people from government and I learned a lot from them. And you know, the usual suspects in academia are pretty interesting too. What's been great about the conference so far? Well, just the astonishing results. Uh, I mean, just amazing things to learn uh, from real empirical work, observations of real people and how they behave in credit markets. One result that really came to mind is that it turns out that people pay less on their credit cards if you tell them there's a minimum payment than if you just tell them how much they, they totally owe. So the law that says there has to be a minimum payment actually makes people uh, run up larger balances on their credit cards. I found that really amazing. So these are topics that where, where people from uh, business schools, marketing departments, people who are psychologists, people who are economists, behavioral economists, Finance, uh, you know, finance people, um, uh, decision scientists, all those, uh, all those different disciplines have something very meaningful to say about uh, about these issues. And so, we have just leading figures from around the world in all those areas together in one conversation, and it's truly a remarkable, uh, remarkable group.